Racers, Phil here from Peak Time Racing. Welcome to our live stream. If you're not watching this live, then you definitely still want to check it out. But here we are going to open up a ton of new Hot Wheels cars. We've got the latest case of Hot Wheels cars. I've got a bunch of them all together. So thank you everyone who has joined so far. And thank you for everyone who has hit that thumbs up button already. If you haven't already, make sure you do. Let's go ahead and start opening up. We've just got a ton of new Hot Wheels. So I thought, you know what, it'd be fun to just open them all up together with you guys rather than doing an official video. So let's go ahead and start that. Uh, I've got, oh man, there's, there's some good ones in this case. We're gonna start it off right over here though. We're gonna start it off with the 1990 96 Porsche Carrera and this one's a yellow variation we originally got this one in white so we got it in blue we did we get it in black yet I think we did get it in black as well and now we've got a yellow one if you guys don't know my favorite color is yellow so obviously I'm pretty excited about this one let's go ahead and open this one up and get a nice close-up look at this one we'll put the packaging down there and there we go we've got the yellow one fully blacked out wheels with those nice mesh inlay in them very, very cool. We've got the nice front light tampo. So great detail on the front end there. Thank you everyone who has joined so far. Hello, hello. Make sure you hit that thumbs up. I appreciate it. Thank you so much, guys. Hey, how are you guys doing on this fine Sunday afternoon? If, if it's uh, Sunday where you guys are, it might be the next day. Uh, it might be Monday if you're watching from overseas. But there we go. We got the nice Porsche Carrera right there in yellow. We'll put that one aside just right here and uh, we'll just start grabbing random cars here. We'll grab some from over here. Uh, the RV there yet. Oh my gosh, this one is crazy. We got this one originally released in the red and now we've got this light blue with kind of like a, looks like a grayish green black uh, back on there. So there we go, RV there yet, tuned out variation, new casting. Yesterday was a leap day. Yes, that's right, it was the 29th, now we're on March 1st. So this is the first live stream of March, first video of March. There we go, RV there yet. Very, very fun casting. If you haven't got this one yet, it's definitely worth getting. This is just, it's just a super different fun casting. Uh, Rosa Drift, thank you very much for the 99 cents super chat. I appreciate that, that really helps out. Thank you so much. There we go, check out the back end of that one. Very, very cool. Got the wheel on the back, got the little camper on there. I don't know how, if this would ever be realistic. Could this ever be realistic in real life? I don't know. This is just seems kind of weird, but we'll put that one aside. All right, next up, we've got the 95 Mazda RX-7 or Mazda, depending on where you live. It's pronounced a little bit differently, but there we go. We've got it in a nice color. Gold wheels on there too. Let's go ahead and pop this one open. Two Jet Z in blue. Yes, we have that. We'll be opening that one up in a second, but there we have the RX-7 those nice gold wheels. And what do we have on the front right here? It says Mazda Speed or Mazda Speed. That's pretty cool. Nice graphics on there, the number seven on there. Uh, nothing as far as tempo work on the back. Cars are from G-Case, yes, yes. These are mostly from G-Case. And I have uh, I have one more special car at the end of this. After we open up all of these cars, I have one more special car to show you guys. We'll do that at the end. But there we go, we'll put that aside. And what do we have here? We've got the Ion Motors Thresher. Thresher? 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 I'm not sure exactly the pronunciation. But this is from the Fast and Furious Spy Racers, a Netflix series show. So very, very cool that they're coming out with the kind of a semi fantasy car. It's kind of an imitation of the Fast and Furious car show. It kind of looks like some sort of muscle car, but we'll go ahead and open up that one. All right, there we go. And like I said, very muscle car-esque. And it's got a very raised back end. And even though the tires on this, they almost look like they're real riders because they're very like thick rubber on them or just tiny wheels on them, but very, very cool looking. I like it. I like it a lot. There we go. We got the nice front end on there. Look at that grill. It's a mean grill. What do you think this guy, what do you think this looks like? What car do you think this looks like the most? Let me know in the comments down below. But this has got some cool spoiler on there. It's hard to say, it's hard to say. All right, we'll put that one aside. And what should we grab next? We'll grab this one down here. We've got the GTR that's falling down there. There we go. We got the Hyper Rocker new color variation on there. Let me know which card you guys like the best so far. All right, we got Hyper Rocker in this white color. We saw this one released in several different color variations. I think this casting came out last year, if I'm not mistaken. We did see it in several different color variations, but there is Hyper Rocker white wheels. I don't know what to say about this one. It's a very interesting casting. It's kind of fun. This would be fun to throw down like a, a jump track or something. Hyper Rocker in white. There we go. Yes, it is. All right, we'll put him aside and let's go ahead and open up the 2017 Nissan GTR R35. 
brand new color variation. This one we've gotten in many different color variations. I might have to do a color variation update video with this casting. And uh, there's a bunch of different color variations for this casting. I really like the front though. Good detail on this one. It's got that new design. This is the, the second variation of this casting because they had a little bit older model year before. Then we got this one here. White with the gray wheels. We've got the, the nice stripe on the top of it as well. And on the back, good detail for the lights. There we go, Nissan GTR. GTR is your favorite so far, there we go. Good, good, good. Make sure you guys hit that thumbs up if you guys like seeing some unboxing videos. Yes, 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 there we go. All right, we'll put that one aside. Uh, ooh, this is one that we had a lot of people ask about and talk about. It is the 1989 Porsche 944 Turbo. This is the new color variation, the gold color variation of this one, very metallic gold. Uh, any treasure hunts? There are some treasure hunts within here. So maybe have a look, we'll see, we'll see. We'll open up a treasure hunt uh, today as well. Uh, let's open up this Porsche as I just crack it open and wreck the packaging, but that's okay, there we go. This is a very, very metallic, shiny, flaked gold paint job on there. Check it out, you can see it really, really shiny in my lights right there. Blacked out wheels with the chrome lip, nice details and stuff. This one has the pop-up headlights in real life and it's got the nice little Porsche logo right there. There we go. Uh, what's my favorite new Hot Wheels car? Oh, there's there's just too many. I cannot pick. I, I don't know. I like the hyper cars. I got to go with like the Bugatti or the Vulcan or something like that. But there we go. There we go. Awesome, awesome. Okay, we'll put that one aside. Next up, ooh, we got a bone shaker here. New color variation of the bone shaker. There's so many bone shakers. There's just so many of them. I have a ton of different color variations. I could probably fill this, this whole board display piece that I have right here. I'm going to actually move this a little bit up here so you guys can see a little bit better, but I could probably fill that whole thing up with bone shakers, but uh, maybe we'll do that in a future video, but there we go. Very, very cool. You like the new Vulcan? Yeah, I got the new Vulcan back there. You can kind of see it. You'll be able to see it a little better in a second there. But there we go. There's the new bone shaker color. I'm liking the, the gold chrome lip on there. Uh, yes, I've got the Chiron. You'll see it in the back in a second there, but there we go. This is kind of like a matte finish paint job too. There we go. Very, very nice. If you guys like bone shakers, this is definitely another one you need to pick up. And there's uh, the both the series of the mystery cars this year included bone shakers. So this is like my third or fourth new bone shaker in the past couple weeks. There's just so many different color variations of the bone shaker. All right, let's move on to the 1976 Greenwood Corvette. I really like this casting. It looks very, very, very cool. Thank you very much, Blaine, for moderating in the chat as well. Appreciate it. You guys, make sure you keep it clean. Awesome, awesome. There we go, 76 Greenwood Corvette. Let's go ahead and pop it open. There we go. And very, very nice. Check this out. I like the I like the color. This color is just becoming a very popular color for a lot of newer cars. It's kind of like, a, this is more of a teal color. It's not as much of a blue, but like there's the new Corvette that has a rapid blue color, which I really, really like. But there we go. Check it out. Check out the back. Check out the wide body on that one. That is crazy. I like the colored lip and all that. Looks very, very cool. I'm a big Corvette guy. I like Corvettes. So there we go. There's, I'm a fan of that one. All right, let's go ahead and pop this one open here. What do we have? Dune It Up is our next one. Black Dune It Up, new color variation of that one. Let's go ahead and get through this one here. Pop it open. Ooh, look at the tires on the back of this one. Didn't notice that in the package. They're very like off-roady type tires on there. Very cool. I like this color variation though. They've had a couple different ones of this one before, but this one looks really cool. Dune It Up, nice glossy black all around, there we go. All right, let's start putting some cars over here. Maybe we can put some of the cars that we've already opened up right over here. Let's do that, why not? And then you guys can see some of the cars that we opened up. If you missed it and you're just joining in the live, you can go back afterwards and you'll be able to see the cars. All right, next up we've got the 42 Willys MB Jeep. 42 Willys MB Jeep. I'm not sure what the MB is, but uh, there we go, Baja Blazers. Let's go ahead and pop this one. Ooh, that one cracked off the card really easily, there we go. Uh, this one, it seems almost like small to scale. I don't know. It just seems a little bit tight, a little bit smaller, but that's okay. Pretty cool. Look at the white interior on there. Nice color on there all around. The big roll cage. I've not found any super treasure hunts in store this year, unfortunately. I wish I have. I wish, I wish I have. But I might have a new treasure, super treasure hunt to show you guys. We'll see. Maybe, maybe, maybe towards the end of this video, I might have a super treasure hunt to show you guys. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see what's coming. All right, here we go. Next up, this is one that I just took from the side here. Custom Ford Maverick. This is a new color variation of the Ford Maverick. There we go. Let's go ahead and pop open this Ford Maverick. Have a look at this one. 
We've got a treasure hunt to open here in a second as well. Uh, this one with a matte black paint job on there with the big flame job on there. Uh, when's the next peg hunting video? I know lots of you guys have been asking. I've been trying to film some cool peg hunting videos. Unfortunately, I just haven't been able to find a lot of cool stuff in stores. But uh, we'll see. I'll, I'll try to get one done for you as soon as I can, guys. There we go. Ooh, look at that orange on the back. That looks pretty cool. I like that. Pretty interesting. If you like the flame job cars, those are, those are pretty cool to collect. All right, let's open up. A new casting, the duck and roll, duck and roll. And we already saw in my news video, I posted that we're gonna be getting a new color variation this one. I think it's a green one that's coming for this one as well. But uh, here's our first one in yellow. Of course, the yellow ducky, new for 2020, you can see. Duck and roll, duck squad, there we go. Check him out. Okay, this is just like, I don't know if this is a solid piece of plastic. And does it do anything? It almost looks like this does something, but no, I guess not. Maybe not. Nothing on the bottom that moves or anything like that. You can see the big exhaust. Nice fan in the back. Duck and roll. Nice pun. Yes, it is a good pun. There we go. Duck and roll. Feel like the duck and roll. That's a pretty fun casting. It's just fun. It's just something different. For fantasy castings, why not come out with something cool like that? Uh, let's grab something from down below here. We're knocking over castings here now. Uh, we'll put some of the castings that we already opened up here as well. Some more of them. There's the Porsche. There's the Corvettes. Put those ones up there. And we've got the gold Batmobile. Brand new color variation of the Batmobile. We've seen this one come out in uh, several different colors, I would say. But there we go. There's our gold Batmobile. Very cool. Very flashy gold. <laughs> you love these Hot Wheels? Awesome. So do I. So do I. There's always some good ones coming up. The next case, guys, the next case that is coming as well, there's a lot of really, really good castings. This is super golden, super shiny, guys. You, you guys might need some sunglasses to watch this video. This is just super shiny gold. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. All right, we'll put that one aside. Let's open up a treasure hunt, the treasure hunt from the G case. And it is the Dodge Charger Daytona Tuned Out Edition. There we go. There we go. Very, very cool. I've, I've got lots of different color variations of this casting, but finally got it in yellow, my favorite color. And it is the Treasure Hunt, you can see right there. There's your Treasure Hunt logo right there. Very, very nice. I like the Treasure Hunt logo, it's fun. Uh, there it is from the front, the big engine on there, the Dodge, and of course, the Daytonas are known for the big wing on there. Check it out. Huge wing, huge wing. We've, we've got this car in a non-tuned version and a tuned version. It's fun that they came out with this casting in two different variations, but this one is the treasure hunt of the case, of the G case. There it is, treasure hunt G case. Put that one aside just up there. You'll be able to see that big wing. Uh, what do we have here? We've got the Grupo X24. This looks to be a new color variation. It looks like a taxi variation. Special feature, see back for details. All right, let's go ahead and see what the back does. Oh, okay, special feature. Something happens with the front lip on this one. Okay, I did not know that. Vehicles are built for ultimate track performance. All right, let's go ahead and see what the front lip does on this one. All right, let's go ahead and see here what this does. Uh, okay, there's the casting, Grupo X24. What does this front lip do? I don't know what this does. Okay, does it does it pull down or pull off? It just moves. I don't really know if it actually does anything though. Yeah, I'm not too sure. Exo training. I think they made five variations of this one. Okay, so that's cool, but I don't really know what this is supposed to do. What is it? What do they mean by this comes apart or something like that? I don't want to wreck it or anything. I'm gonna actually, you know what? I'm gonna put some force to it. There we go. Okay, so this comes down. Oh, no, no, I'm bending it, I'm bending it. Okay, so I'm not too sure exactly what this is supposed to do. I guess it just, okay, I guess it, I see, I see. It just snaps on and off. There we go. So this just snaps up. I guess this is, if it wants to go over a lower, lower stuff on the ground, then it could snap this little spoiler up and then otherwise you can put it down for downforce. Man, nothing too special. All right, we'll put that aside. That wasn't as exciting as I thought it would be. New color for the wheelie chair. Wheelie chair, there we go, Aaron. There we go, cool, cool, cool. Wheelie chair, we got this one in, in many different color variations now. I can't remember, we got silver, we got black. Uh, did we get a white one maybe too? But there is our, whoa, wheelie chair. Oh, it wouldn't be a video if I didn't drop a car. That just seems to always happen, there we go. Wheelie chair, trying to wheel away from me. There it is, wheelie chair. Oh, there we go, I didn't notice the back of it. We got the little logo right there. The flame jobs on there. 
Not a huge fan of Wheelie J. It's a, it's a fun casting. I understand why they did it. It's a cool casting. It's fun to have. All right. Next up, we've got the 85 Honda City Turbo 2. And this one originally came out in white. It was probably, was it, a, was it two years ago? It could be a 2018 casting that originally came out, I think. But we've gotten so many different color variations of this one. We've got it in special edition castings as well, like the uh, premium Hot Wheels cars. And now we got another recolor of the Honda City Turbo 2. So they're really... They're really milking this one. They're really coming out with different ones. But when this first came out in the white, I was actually pretty excited to see it. And it's still a pretty neat little casting to have. If you're a fan of all of like the older style JDM cars, then this is definitely one to have with your collection. Honda City Turbo 2. We'll put him aside up there. And let's go ahead and pop open the brand new color variation of the 2Jet Z or 2Jet Z, however you want to say it. This is the 20, I believe it's 2018 Hot Wheels Legends Tour winner. Yes, 2018 Hot Wheels Legends Tour winner. Um, and this is a new for 2020 casting. We got it originally in the uh, the first color of it, which was like, a, I think it was a silver color, which is the original color of this one. And now we've got it in this nice look blue color. There we go. Where did I get the display case in the background? Check out the link in the description box below. There should be a link to the display case on Amazon, but there we go. Winner, 2018 winner, right? Is that right? Was it 2018? I think it was 2018 because 2019 was a different winner, but there we go. Two Jet Z, new color variation. I expect to see this one in many different other color variations as well. So definitely check it out. We'll have those in the future probably. All right, we'll put that one aside. What else do we have here? We got the heavy hitcher with the chrome chromed out heavy hitcher. Let's go ahead and pop open the heavy hitcher. Special features, see in the back for details. I would assume it's just the hook where you can just hook and this thing goes up and down. Let's go ahead. 2018 winner, thank you very much for the confirmation guys. Uh, there we go, yes, it does just have that little hook so we can tow cars. We'll try it out. We'll, let, let's hook up, uh, there we go. Let's check out the car first. Uh, oh, what do I got here? There we go, perfect. All right, so this one goes up, up and down. It doesn't go up as, as far as I thought, but it does hook up on there. Very, very chromed out on there. All right, let's go ahead and hook, uh, let's hook the, the bone shaker right here. There we go. Oh, 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 let's see here. Let's do it backwards here if we can. There we go. All right, so that pressure, the weight on there, and there we go. It works, it works. They got the chrome heavy hitcher. All right, we'll put the chrome heavy hitcher in the back. We'll leave it down there just like that so you guys can see it. Uh, a couple more cars here. Well, four more, plus I got the one car at the end to show you guys as well. 64 Chevy Nova Wagon Chromed Out Flame Job Series. There it is. Let's go ahead and pop it open here. Get a nice look at this one. Uh, lots of the flame job cars come in like these old muscle car type things, but this is like the old classic wagon on there, blacked out wheels, the gold lip on there. Very, very flame job on there. Wow, okay, that's that's a lot of flames. A lot of flames on this one, all around. There we go, Chevy Nova Wagon, pretty fun car. I'll put that aside. Uh, we got the 52 Hudson Hornet. 50 who I can't remember, is this the first time we've seen the Hudson Hornet? I think we actually did see it before. I don't think this is a new for 2020 casting, but uh, there is the Hudson Hornet. 817 on the side, I like that. Yes, the Hudson Hornet's fun. All right, let's go ahead and open up the Hudson Hornet. And this one, oh, this is a really cool paint job on there. Very matte finish paint job on there. But there is our Hudson Hornet Hot Wheels Rod Rod Squad, it says on there. It's a fun casting. Chrome all around. Cars in a great movie. That's right. The Cars movies. We've seen this one here. There we go. Hudson Hornet. 817. What does the 817 mean? If anyone knows what 817 means, let me know in the comments down below. I'd love to know. I'd love to know. All right, we'll put that one aside. If you guys are enjoying the video, hit that thumbs up, helps me out. Thank you so much if you have already, guys. Next up, we've got the Motosaurus. And Motosaurus, this is the mainline version of Motosaurus. We did get a Hot Wheels ID version of Mortos, uh, of the Motosaurus. I didn't actually receive it in my box, but uh, this one does come as a Hot Wheels ID. Let's go ahead and pop this one open here. And there we go, check out the Motosaurus. They're so colorful, the Motosaurus is just such a colorful car and I like it because these are like like plastic where they actually feel like the, the back of the dinosaur, it's so cool. Such a fun casting. We've seen this one, uh, we've seen several different other variations of this casting. One of them that has like a very, very shiny, I think it was a, the the main or the regular Hot Wheels ID one that came out where it had a super, super shiny paint job on it. 
but this one looks really cool. It's a fun car. It's a very, very fun car. All right. And we've got this one, which is a brand new, new for 2020 casting, the Linster Prototype. Linster Prototype. Okay, I didn't know much about this car coming before I got it in my case. Let's go ahead and pop it open, though, and see what it's all about. Does it have any special features? Vehicles with clear bodies and wheels, plus they're super fast on track. All right, well, we'll have to put it down the track in the future here, but let's go ahead and pop it open and see what this one's all about. It does look like a prototype top speed car. Check out the intakes right there for the aerodynamics. And it's, oh, that's pretty cool, actually. So the intakes would actually cool down the tires when it's driving. This would be a fun car to make in real life if they actually turned a fantasy casting into a real life car like they did with the Bone Shaker and a couple of the other ones. This would be a fun one to make, right? Yes, this is a new casting, new for 2020 casting, the Linster prototype. I don't really know much about it besides it's just new casting. It looks pretty fun. More chrome on there. All right, all right, guys. Uh, so let me know which was your favorite casting that we opened up uh, that we've done so far. I'm gonna show you one last car here, one last special car that I just picked up yesterday. Uh, there we go, lots of cool cars on here. Let's put the, the uh, nice little Daytona treasure hunt the nice little duck and roll right there. Let's put them right there. All right, comment down below, which was your favorite car? Linster, Linster prototype, Jeep GTR? Yes, all right, all right. Okay, the last one that I have to show you guys, a very special one. So if you guys remember, uh, probably about five or six cases ago, I got my Volkswagen T2 pickup Super Treasure Hunt. Well, I traded it because you know what? I'm not a huge Volkswagen guy. I'm more of a Tesla guy. So I traded it. For this, the Tesla Model S Super Treasure Hunt. There we go, Super Treasure Hunt. There we go. Okay, so I wanted to get uh, some more of the Tesla Super Treasure Hunts, and so I found some guy locally that was willing to trade the Volkswagen T2 pickup for the Tesla Model S Super Treasure Hunt. So I'm super, super excited I got it. I got the Super Treasure Hunt Tesla. And actually, before we go, I'm gonna actually show you one other one that I have here. Right behind me. So, does anyone know Tesla was a super treasure hunt before? Does anyone know which Tesla was made into a super treasure hunt for Hot Wheels before? Can you guys tell me in the comments down below? Ooh, is this the only Tesla super treasure hunt? No, it is not. There was one other Tesla super treasure hunt, which I have, and I'll show you guys in a second. Can we get any guesses? Which casting? There we go, Roadster, Roadster, you guys are right. There we go, Tesla Super Treasure Hunt Roadster. That's the other casting that I had. So I wanted to have both the Super Treasure Hunt Teslas, and I'm not gonna be opening these ones up. These ones are gonna stay in their Protecto pack, but this is the newest one as far as Tesla goes. So there we go, we got the two Tesla Super Treasure Hunts, and I'm super excited to have those. And I will be having a special Tesla unboxing video. I'll actually give you one sneak peek of that, one thing that I got from that. I know we just moved on to Teslas all of a sudden, but I did pick up this as well. I found this one in store, the Tesla Convoys, semi-convoys, the Tesla variation. So we are gonna be doing a special on Tesla sometime in the next week, possibly tomorrow. Um, and then we'll open up a bunch of the Teslas. I'll show you guys all the current Teslas, but uh, there we go. That was, I just wanted to show you guys that one that I did pick this one up yesterday. So thank you so much, guys. I appreciate you guys joining this video. If you guys are still here, make sure you hit that thumbs up. I'm sorry if you just joined in and you missed some, but we opened up all of these cars right here. So go back and watch that, guys. And I will catch you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.